Ladies and gentlemen, kicking us off in this one in sky blue, striped white. That is none other than the University of Nairobi's main machine receiving Strathmore Lewis. Big tackle in midfield. Leos with ball in hand. Looking to strike fast. The main machine remain resolute on defense. It's fighting for every scrap of possession. Shemo Kola, Shemo Kola with ball in hand. Okola tackled. It's an uncle. Tip tackle, Arnold Mutai passes it back. Okola on the wing, coming down the blind side. It's a big frame of Shem Okola. Arnold on the base of the rack. Leo's with an advantage, Amalemba to Victor Mola. Victor Mola running through, accelerating, shifting gears. Advantage is over, signaled by referee Arnold Mutai. Mutai. Hint of a forward pass there to Shemo Kola, and the referee pulls it back. Good attacking play there by Leos. But losing that opportunity, ball shifting forward. Play resumes. Scrum down for main machine. Scrum collapses. Main machine on the attack. Try scored by the referee looking to consult his assistant referee just to confirm. No try. Tackle off the ball. Penalty awarded to the main machine.
It's a good uncle tackle by the smallest player on the pitch. Quick tap there by Ken Omaset. Player not 10 meters. Referee sends. Strat Molio's player to the sin bin. Two minutes out. 9v10. Min Machine, despite the difference in size, really holding their own in this one. You can see the disparity between the two sides in terms of weight and size. Leo's with the big boys are being chopped low on defense. Big scrum shaft there by Leo's. Leo's from a disadvantage, his position with ball in hand on the attack. A Malemba takes two, three defenders to bring him down. Arnold Mutai wide passes it to Victor Mola. Victor Mola on the run. But 1v1, the winger, the mid machine winger having none of that. Meanwhile, Leo's lose the ball forward. Victor Mola looking to test the winger, but the winger is up to task. Remember, it's a two minute sin bin in the 10 aside version, just like the 7 aside version. So Leo's playing a one man, two minute game. Scrum down looking to collapse really the front rows of the main machine struggling with holding their own. Explains why they've lost the previous scrum down. Referee resets it. Ball is fed in, ball is out. Kenoma set with ball in hand. Attracts one, two defenders. It's a very bad pass out wide. Takes contact. No clear release. Victor Mola takes contact. Tackle is made. And eventually lose the ball forward. Sinbin period comes to an end. A full complement of 10. 10 v 10. Min Machine versus Leo's.
Victor Moller. Try time, Swat Mullins. Finally, Leo's break the deadlock. A Miss Vazity affair. Long range try by the Leo side, courtesy of Victor Moller. Anong Mutai with the extra two. Strat Molil, seven. Mini Machine, zero. Anong Mita with the extra two. Leo's in the lead. Coming up next, ladies and gentlemen. Kabarak University taking on the Menengai Cream and to finish off the second round of games we will have the Catholic Monks take on Blackblood RC. Ball travels forward. Second half kicks off in earnest. Machine off their feet playing the ball. Arnold Muita gets us going. Barnabas, Gabriel Ayimba, Ayimba shifted to Kola Shem. Shem. Shem is once again brought down. Well handled by the main machine team. Arnold to Barnabas, Barnabas with a wide, long pass. Amalemba is well taken care of by the main machine defense. Just making sure that they complete their tackles. There goes Barnabas. Barnabas passes it forward. And of course the referee calls it. Well, the tackles are really sticking for the main machine. Defending for quite a large portion of this game.
ball is fed into the scrum and finally Arnold Muita. Try time, Leo's. Arnold Muita getting Leo's second try of the game. Bring the scores to Leo's 12. Main machine, zero. Arnold converts his own try, getting the full complement of seven points on offer. Leo's 14, Mid machine, zero. For just joining us, a very warm welcome. Karibu sana to the Nakuru Athletics Club, the 31st edition of the Great Rift Genocide. Hosted and brought to you by Nakuru RFC. Coming up next, we have Kabarak University taking on the Menengai Cream. And after that, to finish off the second round of games, we'll have Catholic Monk second, Kenyatta University. Remember, this is a one day event. Arnold is apprehended. There goes Gideon Makumi. Kumi comes back the blind side. In goes Amalemba. Amalemba. Well tackled, well handled. Mean machine on the break. One of the few instances they've been able to get into the Leo's half. And on the wing, Victor Mola steps in, steps one, steps two, steps three, and accelerates, changing gears. They call him Mola. A hot stepper. Try time, Leo's. Victor Mola gets Leo's third try of the game on the scoreboard. Cutting through the mid machine defense like a hot knife on butter, weaving his way through, scoring Leo's third try. Victor Mola brings scores to Leo's 19. Muita with the extra two. Leo's 21. Mid machine. Zero. Chanjokoza <laughs> Ken Oma set on the break. Ken Oma set. Isolated though. Passes it back. Finds his teammate but loses the ball forward. That is Felix. Leo's on the attack with a scrum advantage. Amalemba, Elton. And he's brought down with a beautiful tackle. Min Machine fighting for all it takes. Player holding on. I 
Menegai Cream and Kabarak University proceed to the player holding area. Referee playing an advantage, Arnold shifts the ball to Shem, Shem with an overhead pass. He was playing. Strong scrummaging there by Strathmolios. Drawing closer to the try line, all it needs is a pick and grounding. Could easily have been a penalty try there. The referee. Meanguka. <laughs> Hey, Paul, it's an idea of Karatasi. Wow. I imagine you'll call me Isma Mia. Penalty try awarded to the Leos, extending the lead, ladies and gentlemen, to Strath Malios, 28. Min Machine, zero. What's that you imagine? You don't know what I'm saying. You don't know. Machine on the attack. Gabriel Laimba in trouble. It's a tough. Gabriel Laimba sent to the bin. Machine look to score their first try of the game. Then contact. One man advantage. Passed out wide, but to nobody in particular. That signals the end of that game.